Hello and welcome back to the channel. Spooky season has started in War Thunder now, so the hangar has been completely redecorated uh, with all the pumpkins and blood and trees, stuff like that. Pretty cool. Uh, the pack sales have also begun, so I thought, why not pick up the Type 90B Fuji? This is a Rank 7 11.3 tank for Japan. Uh, I don't really have much experience in playing Japan, but I know that for a fact this tank is really good. It has a four second uh, reload speed, which is incredible. But let's go into a battle and see how we do with it. I hate this laser warning. Your teammates can laser you as well, which just does not help. Everyone seems to be charging. Charging forward. I don't know why I decided to go into the artillery. Just watch one drive by. There we go. Man, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Fine, we're in we're in a pretty good spot. We can sit here. Oh. Oh, I can't see because of the bus. And the tree. There's always a tree in the way, isn't there? Oh, yes. This is coming together now. If you can be really aggressive with the Fuji, then... Come on, come on. It is barrel. No idea what he's doing. I love just being able to consistently shoot without having to worry about reloading. This matter how quickly top tier games like just go as they do, like. Well, one team does really well, or the other just gets stomped. <laughs> Not like lower tiers where you can consistently have matches that go on for a while. And got the guys auto loader. Off some smoke. Okay, 52. Put an end to us there. Almost at 2,000 points there as well. Look at that. That was incredible. That was like a really aggressive play. How did I just flip the tank nearly? What is going on there? I think the entire team went towards the C point. Oh, not never mind. I'm just dead here. Or not. Because somehow he just... I don't even know how he missed that. Uh, but now I'm stuck in a really bad spot because that is literally just his spawn. Like everyone has the same idea right now. Oh, uh, what? Oh my god. Surely not. Surely not. Uh, what? Why am I having such trouble with bridges and just slopes today? There we go. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. The bomb. What is happening? And of course. Well, we're either going to kill this 2S6 or he's somehow going to take cover. Oh, he did not take cover. Never mind. <laughs> Maybe we can get the wolf pack as well. That'd be a nice cheeky little kill. Yep. And that is um, pretty much all we can do there. <laughs> oh, where are you? There you are. Uh, 
There we go. Push the guy on A. Before he repairs. There we go. We dealt with him. Cap on A. I see an um, incoming missile of some sorts. And we are on Normandy. There we go. That goes number one. There goes number two. Michael! Don't leave me here! My house! My Okay, we should not have survived that. There's another one though. Oh. I, I think we may have just accidentally gone out into the uh, the death zone. Challenger. And that guy who somehow missed an ATGM shot on us. <laughs> what is going on right now? Alright, nice. Somehow we survived that. I have no idea how. <laughs> Well, this is um, certainly going to be a win, <laughs> providing they don't have an infinite amount of cast. That was a decent match, that one. Ah, uh, yes, the 11.7 Sherman. I remember you. I've seen you many times. He <laughs> clearly must have that upgraded ERA package, bringing him up to 11.7. There goes one. There goes a second. See if we can get around towards the B point. Please go away. More trees, more trees. I hate trees. Let's go Leopard 2. We must continue the advance. There's a guy right in front of you. What are you doing? Push me! What are you doing? You... What are you doing? Get off. What is bro doing? Oh, bro has got me killed. Hello. Hello. Oh. That was like a mini jump scare right there. I'll try to shoot him. Um, gun is not loading, and that is pretty much me dead. For some reason, I can't seem to hear engine sounds today. Maybe I've just gone deaf. Oh, no, 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 no. I, I hate Cass. There we go. I think that was revenge on the same guy. Please help me repair. Nope. Of course. Nice. I think I may be dead before I can uh, get this off. Yeah, I think I might be dead here before I can hit him. It's a shame. Oh no, we still got him. Nice. Driver. 
And there we go. Whew. Keep going around. No idea why the engine is so loud. <laughs> Well, we walked into the dragon's den there. Um, how did my rangefinder not work there? There we go. <laughs> Thank God for the four second reload. I think that, yeah, looks like most of them to the left towards that B point. Try and get on this uh, rock. The guy right in front of me somewhere. Oh, there he is. Is that the boxer? Uh oh. Probably shouldn't have done that. No. Of course. Now, while you're seeing the footage and thinking, oh, yeah, that's pretty good. Um, <laughs> off camera, I have died many times. Many, many times. Although, I think mainly the issue with that is... It kind of sucks when you don't have a lineup for these um, sport vehicles when it's just the one. I mean, I have the, I have backups for it, but I only want to really use a backup if I'm doing well. Unfortunately, I'm not like the um, other content creators where they have like just unlimited backups for vehicles. Sad reality of this uh, game is there will be a lot of suffering before you can make it to top tier when you're starting any nation. I mean. Realistically, this is my first time playing Japan properly. Oh, I am just half asleep today. <laughs> I swear down. Critical hit. Here you go. Um, can you please leave me alone? Please repair, I beg. And just like that, I've already been shot again. <laughs> what is happening? Right, let's finish this guy. Oh my! Guy right in front there. Nama. I think it's a Nama. There's that one. Let's go snipe some more German tanks. There are multiple times this match when I should have been dead. Uh, and I spoke too soon. In a down tier, this thing feels pretty good. Just when you get up tier, the new battle rating changes, it feels like, um, well, I mean, you're going to get outperformed by T90s and 287s and all that. I mean, the shell only has, what, 481 mils of pen? So, kind of got to hit them dead on in the weak spots for not to really do much. That was uh, a waste of a backup. Well, the premium squad has certainly rocked up, including myself. Well, that is the advantage of having a faster reload rate than your enemy. <laughs> Do you know I'm coming up behind him? Yep, he does. But I also saw you, Buster. And speaking of tanks from front. Okay, okay, we ricocheted that one. The... Why? Oh, the gun depression is so poor on this thing.
Alright, alright. There we go, we got revenge on him. <laughs> Whee! Don't know what he was trying to do. I look away for one second. <laughs> that is a striker. Needs to be dealt with. There we go. Yep, he's dealt with. I'm trying to take care of that challenger. There we go. Very nice. Very nice stuff. And that was just in time. It's a Type 90B Fuji. Initially, I, going into this, I was thinking, this will be an amazing tank because of the reload rate. And that does stand true. However, the issue is you basically have paper armor. And there is a chance of getting up tiered constantly, which is another issue um, I've been facing with this. The shell isn't the best because it only has 440 mils of pen, which <laughs> when you're in the... 12.0, 11.7 BR bracket is um, it's not great at going through tanks, and you will ricochet a lot of them. Other than that, though, mobility is great, reload is great, and if this was in a proper lineup, it would be incredible alongside the other top tier Japanese tanks, like the TKX, for example. However, I do not, and I only possess this one vehicle, which means if you are looking to buy this, then there is obviously going to be the issue with. You're only playing one match and leaving constantly, which means you are essentially bringing down the team. <laughs> but, I mean, that is unavoidable when you're starting out on a new nation. It's the same that goes for America, Germany, USSR. Although, if I was to pick this vehicle, I don't know if I'd pick this as a first choice. If you're grinding um, any nation, I'd probably start with the easier ones, like Russia, which is really good for survivability with the T-Series uh, tanks. Or Germany, they've got some pretty good ones as well. Like the Panzer Battalion. Uh, but yeah, no, that's about everything really. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like, comment and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.